Hi there and welcome back. I'm really excited for this week's video. This uh, should be an Etsy kit video, but um, this time I think I'm just going to go ahead and use the kit that I made that I sneak peeked on my Instagram. Uh, I think it was last week. So uh, this is the kit that I purchased the um, clip art online and the papers and stuff. I purchased them. So I made this kit with them. So here, I'm just gonna show you uh, the kit. I think you guys saw it in a previous video, so I'll just go through it real quick. But I'm really excited to use it. Uh, I did try and switch the colors midway through making it. So you've got some lighter pink and some darker pink. Um, so I don't know if that's gonna work. We'll see how it looks. It might look really good. It might not look really good. It might be okay. So I guess I'll find out. So I did pre-plan a little bit um, we are moving so this coming week we have to pack and clean like crazy we just tackled the office today so if it sounds a little echoey it's because um, there's not a lot of stuff in here right now so if my voice sounds different it's because there's an echo so basically uh, my next week is going to be uh, work my last week of work uh, at the location I'm at now and I'll be transferring to one in uh, Orlando and then mostly cleaning and packing. The last time we do trash here and recycling. And then I fly out uh, next Monday the 28th. So I need to check in for my flight on Sunday. So I think I'm just gonna go ahead and start. I might not talk a lot during this video, just to try and make it a little bit shorter, but we'll see how that goes. So I wanted to work on the sidebar first, but then I realized that if I wanted to have it the same height as the date covers, then I would need to do those first. So here are my date covers with the different colored headers, and I think I'm gonna alternate between gray and pink. So I'll just do it the same colors that are in the dots. And I thought I made these tall enough, but I guess not. So I will just have to deal with it and do what I normally do when the date covers aren't tall enough and just do this to kind of cheat a little bit. All right, so there we go. Now I have my height for my quote box, which I don't know what I did with it right now. So the quote box that I made, because this is kind of like a fashionista, like shopping type of kit that I made with the, with the papers and the colors and the artwork, that uh, I made the quote, I put the quote, Cinderella is proof that a new pair of shoes can change your life. So I'm going to use that. I don't have a lot of stuff around me because I'm trying to use as much of this as possible for this kit, but I feel like the stickers are everywhere. This last gray header, and that is crooked. So I'll try and fix it somewhat by putting this one down a little bit straighter. And then I made a little weekly box for the dinners. I had wanted to use the littles with the dinners this time around, but I just realized that I didn't make enough boxes to cover over here in the sidebar. So I'm gonna have to think of what to do in a minute. So this kit, <laughs> I forgot to make a habit tracker and then like a regular box for just like next week type things or things like that. So I had to go into my Etsy stash, which I really don't like doing when I'm not doing an Etsy kit, but because I don't have a lot of my things with me right now, I kind of can't help it. So you're going to have to forgive the lapse of this because you guys know I normally don't touch any Etsy stickers whatsoever when I'm doing a no Etsy kit. So um, this is from Isha B Prints. And I'll just be using two stickers from uh, this kit. It's her Queen Bee kit that I will be using in the future, so you guys will see it again. But there's eight of these boxes, so I only need the, uh, the one. And then I will also be using her habit track, one of her habit trackers, because I forgot to make 
habit trackers for this kit. Like I'm looking through my stickers, my sticker pages, and I'm not seeing them. And I completely forgot to add them in. That's why I had six, uh, what is it, build two stickers? <laughs> because I forgot about the habit trackers, which I did want to add in, so. Oh well. And then just add this pink habit tracker in it. And then I'll have to figure out what to do. I think it had some washi strips that I can probably use here. There's some white peeking through, but I'm just gonna have to deal with it. I pulled out my ever trusty Mambi sticker books <laughs> to help me fix this. Uh, I went ahead and uh, flipped through and I found this sticker that I think kind of fits it the most. So I'm just gonna try and cut it down real quick to size to finish this part off of my sidebar. At least that worked out, so I kind of really like that. I'm just gonna leave it and then, you know, maybe I wanna put a little decorative sticker there later or something that works out fine. I don't think I'm gonna have a lot of littles and things next week because lit literally <laughs> everything's gonna be um, pack and clean, pack and clean work. So first I think, yeah, I'm gonna put down my work stickers and I will keep the theme of the colors going. So Friday is going to be a little bittersweet for me. I have gotten to know my coworkers a little bit in the little bit amount of time that I've been there. And I can honestly say that I am going to miss working with them because they are a, a very nice people and they're a fun bunch to work with. So it does make me a little bit sad to be leaving them. I want to try and do a no white space spread here. So I'm going to see how that works out as well. As you guys know, I like staggering these. So I think I'm gonna keep that going this week. The only thing is, now I don't have washi strips for that. But I do have my to-dos and today's, so I will use those to cover and we'll see how this goes. Normally, I don't like black ink in the kits that I print because it does tend to smudge a bit, but this one seems to be doing relatively well, so I hope it stays that way. I had been debating on whether or not to tell my best friend that we were moving back because I really wanted to surprise her by showing up at uh, her job when she got off one day. We will be hopefully moving uh, very close to them. We, After we got married, we actually got an apartment very close to where they, her and her husband live. So that was really nice to be able to go and hang out with her pretty much whenever I wanted when I was off work and get to see her. So she was really sad to see us go and the fact that we had just gotten to be neighbors I think we were only neighbors for about oh my goodness like three months so anyway <laughs> as I was saying I debated whether or not to tell her and just show up like I said and surprise her but I decided against it because I figured that, you know, she's, she's very vocal when she's excited, so I figured if I just showed up right in front of her out of nowhere, um, you know, she might start screaming. And I was right. Uh, I videotaped the whole thing. I will not be putting it up. <laughs> I FaceTimed her, but I watch it uh, because it makes me smile, you know, to know that someone missed me that much and was that excited to hear that I will be coming back. Not that my parents were not excited. They are very excited that we are going to be back in Florida and very close to them. It's just, you know, when people have the kind of reaction that she had to the news, it kind of makes you feel good. I want to do my decorative full boxes next, but I'm having a little bit of an issue because I know that they're not going to cover this yellow and there is no yellow in this kit. So I lied, I am gonna have to use a few more stickers from the Queen Bee kit from Isha Bee Prints. So I'll just use some of these. I know I'm not gonna need them all when I use the kit. So 
this kind of works out just fine. Uh, hopefully the little bit of glitter that's showing in the kit won't take away from the other stickers and it won't look out of place, but I won't know until I place everything down. I'll probably have to use um, another color to cover these up down here. I'm not sure yet. I might not have to, but I think it looks okay so far. And my nail polish is just gone. It's just damaged. It's still wet. So I think I'm just going to have to take it off after the video. I'm gonna put my weekend banner down here so I will have to do my littles and any appointment boxes or things in these two and hopefully I will be able to have enough to cover but I am definitely going to need that extra washi from her kit or not washi the headers I didn't want to make like your traditional weekend banner with the little banners on it so I just did script which I find is really pretty and I did it big enough that you could see it but thin enough that it wasn't so bulky but even with the script weekend I'm probably not going to do as good a job as I would like. I am going to raise it up though because I feel like it would look better if it was higher up and because this is the script I'm afraid to peel it up. So wherever that landed, that's where it's staying. While I was off camera, I realized that Silly me, I forgot I did make headers with this week and next week, so I just went out and switched these two. You guys aren't gonna be able to see it, like I said in the previous video. Um, the font that I used is very thin, so you can. See it's great for the date covers, not so great for the headers when you shrink it down that much. I do have some bill dues, which have already been paid, but I will go ahead and put a sticker down for those as well. And that actually helps me out because it covers up those pieces that I was wondering so there'll be two less pieces that I have to worry about so Monday and Friday would be those days also the girls for the artwork are all very very pretty my absolute favorite one though is her I think she's absolutely gorgeous she is the largest decorative piece in the kit uh, but I do have one of each girl so there's also two of the girls there's a brunette and um, black hair there is no redhead at least not with the artwork that I got I'm just going to do some littles to finish up these days here, that way I don't have to worry about any more headers or anything like that. And then I do have the littles in gray. I can just start doing decorative or functional or anything like that it will be the last time we're doing the trash and recycling here next week so I want to remember to put the little icon down for that I also will need to do laundry a couple of days next week instead of just usually one time maybe every other week I do laundry twice a week And then I know definitely I will have to do laundry on Sunday. So that way I'll have everything, most of everything clean 
that I need to take on Monday. So we'll probably have to do groceries on Tuesday just because we're trying to use up what we have left and we don't want to have extra that will just have to be thrown out. So we're just going as we need it now. I also want to remember to check the mail, which is the last time I'll be able to check it. My husband will still be here, but I want to make sure that I check it one last time. I also want to do my next plan with me. Since I'll be busier towards the weekend, I'll probably try and do my filming on Friday. So I'll put my sticker down for that, which it came out a little bit bigger than I wanted, but at least it's not so big that it goes above and below. I made a little coffee break one because we're going to be so busy that I'm going to want to treat myself. I don't necessarily drink coffee a lot, but I do want to treat myself maybe to some Starbucks this coming week because we are going to be so busy. And I just realized, guys, that I put down my work stickers, but I, again, I forgot to do a sticker for the highs and lows, which I did write. I just forgot to do a sticker for those. So maybe I can write it in on the work ones later. The little me time I'll probably do for Sunday after we watch church. I would also like to try and have a date night before I leave uh, since I don't know how long it's going to be before he gets to Florida. We're still waiting on some specifics. So I'm going to probably put this one here with the little dog. So we'll do it hopefully do a date night on Saturday next week last thing is just to do the deco I started making this kit before I knew we were moving there are stickers that I'm not going to be able to get to use but since I do have quite a few left over I can maybe pull these into another kit uh, another time and then be able to finish using them all I hope you guys liked the video I had a lot of fun designing the kit I will definitely have to make some changes to it like I said before but I am quite happy with the way that it turned out still so it kind of looks somewhat like I did this on purpose. If you are not yet a subscriber, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss updates on when I post future videos. If you are one of my subscribers, thank you guys so much for sticking with me. I will try and have videos up while I'm gone so that way I don't miss a week. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!